number of years ago, I had a dream. I had several dreams, quite a few dreams, but this was back, oh, I don't know. I don't know if it was shortly after we um, had... Probably almost 10 years ago. Yeah, probably 10 years ago. It was after we left ministry. And um, so in this dream, some people came to the door um, to visit and uh, knocked on the door and I opened the door. And so I went down to the basement where Paul was to tell him that we had company. And, and when I got down there, um, he was in a box, as well as about another two people. I'm not sure who they were, but there was, uh, I think, about three boxes there. And he was in this box, kind of cardboard box, kind of. And so I went down and I said, um, so-and-so is here. Would you like to come out of your box? <laughs> And he said, no, I like it in my box. So he's going to share a little bit about being in the box. <laughs> Angie told me this dream and, and told some others who we were um, relating more with at that time. And it was all pretty, it was pretty clear to all of us that this dream was actual fact. I was in a box. And I really did like it in the box. It was safe. It was comfortable. We had, uh, as we shared last night, had been in ministry, stepped out in 2001 from that, and, and kind of gone into this uh, kind of wilderness place. And because of uh, probably some hardness in my heart, I was, I, I, I was good in my box. So when Angie shared how the, in the dream, she knocked on it and asked me, do you want to come out? And I said, no. I was like, yeah, I can, that's right. That's the way I feel. I knew conceptually that it would probably be the right thing to do would be to get out of the box. But I didn't really want to get out of the box. We had some times of prayer together with some others. Uh, Don and Sharon were part of that. There were times of praying for me to get out of my box, and probably there was times I maybe partially got out. But the full getting out of the box didn't happen until six months ago. If you want to know what happened there, you got to watch the video from last night, because I'm not going to tell the whole story again tonight. But it's the word of the Lord. One, one word from God can change your life. One word from God blew up my box. <laughs> and, and I'm out of it now. But in the box is a place of indecision. As a Christian, I would you know, say things different than, than what I was actually living out inside my box still following the Lord, still doing some preaching and, and different things, but really, uh, I wasn't free. And one word from the Lord changed all that. And it connects with getting a sense of my purpose. When you get a revelation of what God's purpose is in your life. It blows everything 